In this video, we'll take a look at Capital One's checking and savings accounts for children to see if this is a match for your family. If you have children, it goes without saying you want to set them up for success. One important aspect of this is to teach them about how to handle their finances correctly. Banks are becoming increasingly aware of this and they're providing accounts for families to where the parents can help the children learn about how to manage their money. But finding the right bank with the right features can be a bit of a challenge. So let's get right into it. We'll start off with what Capital One calls their money teen checking account. Now the name is a little bit misleading because this account is actually available for anyone eight and above. On this account, there are no minimum balance requirements and no fees associated with the account. A debit card is also provided for this account, but with features that will give peace of mind to the parents. The way this account is set up is as a joint account. So the parents and the child will both have access to the account but with two different interfaces. The child will be able to see certain aspects of the account, but will not have full authority to do anything on the account. The parent has controls whether to lock the account or unlock the account, and their version of the app also allows them to transfer money into the account for, let's say, allowances or things like that. They can also track activities on the account, giving them peace of mind that they know what purchases are being made. Giving them the independence to use a debit card while simultaneously having the ability to oversee what they're spending on gives you the opportunity to have teachable moments to where you can interact with your children and teach them about financial management. You can also link with the external accounts so that you can transfer money into and out of the account. Now on this checking account, you actually get a 0.10% interest rate, which admittedly is not very high, but most checking accounts don't offer anything, so it's a little bit of a bonus. Capital One also offers a kid's savings account. Again here, there's no fees and no minimum balance requirements, and they have an APY of 2.5% on this account. Now, I am a little bit disappointed that with Capital One's regular savings account, they offer a 4.35% APY, while with the children's account, they only offer a 2.5 APY. With this account, you can also set up automatic savings. So if there's something periodic that goes into the account, let's say an allowance or some other regular deposit that would need to go into the savings account, then that can be set up to transfer automatically to here as well. This can be linked to both a Capital One account as well as external banks. So no matter where you're transferring from, you'll have that opportunity. And then if you needed to set up multiple accounts for multiple children, you could also do that as well. A grandparent could actually open an account for a child as well, but the child would have to be at least 12 years old in order for this to happen. In order to transfer funds from from this account, Capital One would require the adult who signed on as the joint account owner to authorize that transfer. Let's say the child has a special event, a birthday, or some other special event where they would be receiving donations from someone. Then the check could be written in their name and it could be deposited into their account. It wouldn't have to be written to an adult. This makes giving to the child a little bit easier for those outside. They don't have to give cash or any other form of payment. They can use a check written in their name in order to deposit the money directly into their account. I hope this video was helpful for you. If it was, please subscribe to the channel. Again, thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next video.